In this video, you will learn about parameters that modify how the hot end moves during the printing process. You can find these parameters by clicking the settings icon found on the travel tab and checking the parameters you want to see on the normal view. The combing mode parameter allows you to enable the printer to travel inside the printed part without retracting the filament. The no skin option limits the movement over the infill and the all option allows it to travel anywhere, including over the shell. The main purpose of this mode is to save time during a print by skipping a large number of retraction instructions. The avoid parts when travelling parameter modifies the combing mode to allow movement only on parts where the printer has not yet printed on that layer. This is to avoid leaving filament on top of an already printed layer. Z-hop is when the printer raises the hot end over the current layer to avoid leaving oozed material. This group of parameters allows you to configure when the printer does this action and set the distance raised from the current layer. Enabling Z-hop when retracted raises the hot end during every retraction. The default height is equal to the layer height. Enabling Z-hop at extruder switch raises the hot end during the tool exchange operation. This is to avoid leaving strands between the part and the silicone cloth. The height is shared between both heads. Enabling Z-hop after prime tower raises the hot end after printing the prime tower before moving to the part. This is to avoid leaving strands between the tower and the part. Enabling Z-hop at layer change raises the hot end when it finishes the current layer and has to move to the start of the next layer. The default height is equal to the layer height.